3,000 satellites. A network is important as the roads in ancient times. Our plan was never to save them all. We only focused on those vital to the war effort. That alone was worth the risk of staying in space far longer than any of us should have. Besides exercise, the only thing to do during our off-duty hours was watch what was happening on Earth. We had no control over what the spy birds observed. That was determined by the military. But we did see a lot of battles. We got the first looks at the mega swarms of Central Asia and the American Plains. Massive, miles across. Like the American Buffalo must have been. Our fragile little biosphere. With massive ecological devastation. All those fires. It was like looking down on a primitive alien planet. A billion tiny orange specks where electrical light should have been. It seemed like the whole world was burning. We estimated the ash count as an equivalent to a nuclear exchange between America and the former Soviet Union. That doesn't include the actual exchange between Iran and Pakistan. Watching those flashes gave me eye spots for days. From our perspective up there, it was hard to have hope. Sometimes I'm asked if we regretted our decision to stay. I can't speak for my mates. On the deathbeds, they both said they'd do it again. I won't disagree. I don't regret the loss of bend density, the physical therapy, or the prolonged exposure to cosmic rays. We did make our choice, and I would like to think we made a difference. <laughs>